Welcome to the Mental Health in Black and White channel, where we're here to simplify complex issues and make them more accessible. I'm Zen the Zebra, and I am your host. If you're new here, welcome aboard. We release videos every day, so be sure to subscribe and turn on your notifications so you don't miss any of our amazing content. Today, we're diving deep into a significant topic, dealing with toxic parents. Many people have asked for guidance on how to cope with toxic parents, and it is a challenging issue. Toxic family dynamics can be emotionally exhausting and complicated, so let's explore some valuable tips that might help you navigate this situation, improve your mental well-being, and perhaps even mend your relationship with your parents. Number one, get into therapy. If you can, seek therapy. Therapy is a powerful tool for dealing with difficult family dynamics. It provides a safe space to vent, process your emotions, and receive support. Therapy can help you gain perspective, set boundaries, and develop coping strategies. Look into local therapists, school counselors, employee assistance programs, also known as EAPs, or online therapy platforms like BetterHelp if you need accessible options. Number two, set and uphold boundaries. Establishing boundaries, even if your parents don't respect them, is essential for your well-being. Boundaries protect you emotionally and physically. They can involve limiting your time around toxic family members or creating safe spaces, like adding locks to your room. Communicate your boundaries calmly when you can, but remember that setting boundaries is primarily about protecting yourself. Number three, minimize time at home. If you live with toxic parents, consider minimizing your time at home. Spend time elsewhere, such as studying at a friend's house, staying late at school or work, or joining extracurricular activities. Create a schedule that limits your exposure to toxic environments. Number four, save your money and get out. If you're living with toxic parents, make a plan to move out as soon as possible. Saving money and becoming financially independent is crucial. Living in a toxic environment can have long lasting effects on your mental health. So prioritize your well-being. Number five, figure out what you want. Take time to reflect on what you want from the relationship with your parents. Your needs, not society's expectations, should guide your decisions. Consider what you need and what they can realistically provide. Finding common ground, even if it means setting modest expectations, can help you navigate this complex relationship. Number six, get other support. Seek support from therapists, friends, and other family members. Discussing your experiences with trusted individuals can be cathartic and help reduce the emotional burden. Support groups such as Al-Anon or al for families affected by addiction can provide valuable insight and camaraderie. Remember that toxic family dynamics are challenging and change may not happen overnight. Prioritize your well-being, set boundaries, and seek support to help you cope with the situation. Ultimately, your mental health and happiness are paramount. If you'd like a mental health journal to assist you in your journey, check out our free journal linked in the comments below. Your mental health matters and there is support available to help you navigate these difficult circumstances. If you've faced similar situations or have additional tips to share, please leave a comment. Your experiences and insights can be incredibly helpful to others dealing with toxic family dynamics. Thank you for tuning in and remember, you're not alone in this journey. Take care and I'll see you next time.